ตาแนน We have a new product from Horio. This is the Horio V60 Suiren. It's the newest design of a V60 uh, V60 dripper from Horio, where you can remove the different leaves and um, it doesn't have walls, right? So the only thing that remained, um, as far as the V60 is concerned, is the ribs, right? The spiral ribs. So we're gonna open this Hario Suiren, and I'm gonna show you. Um, I'm sure you're wondering, the box is very thin. Uh, there is a reason for that, right? So when you open the box, you will get the base. So this is your, your removable base, okay? And then your adapter. Okay, so this is not the V60, wait. Okay, here in this box is the first set of leaves. Um, well, these are actually the ribs. I just call them leaves because they look like leaves. <laughs> right, so these, these are the different ribs of the Soiren. And you have 12 of these. So when you assemble it, it actually, um, let me just get this. When you assemble it, it actually resembles the shape of the spiral inside your V60. So I'm gonna show you how to um, assemble it. You will see, um, you will see like a tab here on top there there is a dot there that should be face uh, that should be placed on the lower side of your um, adapter right so we're gonna put in the first leaf you see that um, dot there it goes under Right, and the Hario logo is facing outside, facing out. Right, so that is your first leaf. Right, let me do the rest. Okay. Okay, so we have half of the Suiren. Let's get the other bumps. I'm gonna put the rest of the leaves or the ribs. They call it the ribs. There. So we have the we have the complete Soiren look right here. Okay. Now with the adapter and the leaves and the ribs in place, we can actually put it um on the base so you just have to find the grooves for it and then we have a base here is a Hario server and I'm gonna show you that we can use it without the base okay so when you're brewing your coffee so you're gonna want to put it like this right and of course it fits perfectly but you can also remove this part and then put it like that. It will work as well. Um, let me try to let me try the other. Okay, let's try the other type of server of uh, from Hario. Yeah, it fits better here with this server, right? But of course, um, you can always use the base and it works perfectly. Actually, I've already used the Hario Suiren, so 
I got it the night before my bar takeover in the Philippine Coffee Expo 2024. And I've only calibrated it once before I used it the whole um, three hours of my bar takeover. And it was amazing. So for the whole duration of my bar takeover, I actually brought the origami with me. So I got two different, um, two different drippers on the ready during my bar takeover. But I would, um, for each batch that I would try, I would always, um, I would always opt to using the soy ren over the origami just because it tastes differently. Um, I haven't done any extensive tests with the soy ren, but of course I'm gonna share it with you in the future. Of course, I want to compare it with the normal V60. Yeah, with the how 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 the water would behave. Of course, the normal V60 has walls, and the Soiren doesn't. So, the the water should interact differently with the Soiren. As I've said, I've used it the whole three hours, the whole duration of my bar takeover during the Philippine Coffee Expo. Um, so the people there saw the Soiren in action. But for those of you who did not get the chance to visit me during my bar takeover in the Philippine Coffee Expo, we're gonna brew with the Hario Soiren right now. We're gonna use the Easy Presso ZP6 for this um, coffee. Oh, by the way, the coffee that we're using today is from Escolta Coffee Company. This is the Zicho San Roque CR95 Natural. Um, let's prepare the dripper. It uses the normal uh, conical filters. Okay, so right now I am using the Cafec Abaca Plus. Okay, and it works. It, you don't need, you don't really need any um, any practice with the uh, Suiren because it works exactly the same as a regular V60. Okay, um, let me just throw the rinsing water. Right. Okay. All right, let's start. Okay, um, I haven't figured out yet if 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 the water flow is actually really um, faster than the regular V60. But I, I will be doing that tests to compare the different drippers based off of the um, Sui Ren, the, higher, the Hario Sui Ren. Plus, it looks, it simply looks very nice. It looks different. It looks very unique. I actually poured um, on the sides of the paper in purpose just to see if it will have an effect um, but I don't see any um, any excess water leaking out so yeah I'm very interested in what will happen all right Very floral. It's very floral. Wow. 
okay, so the CR95 um, from Escolta Coffee Company is actually um, the same beans that Blue Bottle ordered from the Philippines way before. Right, so the Hario Suiren comes in different colors. Um, I've only, uh, you, can, you can buy just the ribs alone without the base, so it doesn't, um, it doesn't cost that much. So it's available in yellow, red, blue, purple, I think I've seen pink, and white. And I'm not sure if there's clear, but if they made a clear, version of this that would be that would look really nice so if you want to get your hands on the new suiren um, open your instagram look for kape kalakal and then send them a dm um, right now their shopee store is um is having problems with the account they are available on instagram so just shoot them a message tell them that you want the suiren and then um, make your transaction there. I believe there are they are opening a new account in Lazada. Hopefully, the problem with their uh, Shopee store gets resolved soon. Right. I am enjoying this dripper so much that I haven't used any other dripper in the past days. But yeah, I will be doing more tests in the future. But for now, Thank you so much for watching. In the next videos, I'm gonna show you more about coffee. Bye!